Fukushima Emergency Operations Center. The area near the expressway is still extremely dangerous. Those in the vicinity are instructed to leave immediately. If you need to access the train station, please take a seat and avoid the process. Blockades have been erected throughout the area to avoid accidents. 
Shoot to kill! Your mind. Uh, 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 
going in. All right. Let's get this over with. Not bad.
Guess Cloud won't be joining us after all. No need to assume the worst. I'm sure he's fine. You saw him in action, didn't you? Guy's a soldier. Goddamn one-man army. Hmm. You think he's a keeper? been up to, huh? <laughs> Giving public security the runaround. That's what. Had to draw them away from the station somehow. Nicely done. Well, can't argue with results, huh? <clears throat> what? <sighs> hmm. Wait. Hmm? Got a question for you all. What? Ever been attacked by an invisible enemy? Uh, what? Wearing robes. Came and went like the wind. <laughs> Thought they were invisible. They were, at first. Only saw them after she grabbed me. A new Shinra weapon, maybe? <laughs> More like a panic-induced hallucination. <clears throat> Never mind. Forget I said anything. Suit yourself. Come on, let's move up. A lot of people here. From and in the freight car, too. Because of the evacuation order, maybe? Lucky us. We've got a crowd to hide here. Head for the front of the train to hold them. Your understanding and cooperation is appreciated. How dare they say they're doing this for the Highway collapsed right in front of us. Wow, well, we get tons of these people riding in the freight car. I guess they don't have much choice. Are you the one who grabbed the knee? Sorry, I just need to bump. Huh? Thank goodness I made the train. No thief skin, my money. Man, everyone's on edge. Of course they are. The hey, glass sector three and sky. All I want to do is pass out. If you're about out. to unburden yourself. Don't. Yeesh. You don't make it easy. They even Why have would anyone do there? something like that? Never mind. Sorry to disturb Wait, what the? Oh, that's hey, you got a sec? My daughter now lives in Sector 8, yeah, so... I've gotten out of bed this morning. Just called in sick. Looks like I won't be getting home tonight. Have they caught the perpetrators Just yet? Alone, all right? You're, uh, holding up pretty well, huh? Even after what we saw at the station and all over Sector 8? Why don't I'm you learn to take a hint, buddy? Well, my hands are still shaking. You get used to it. Something to look forward to. Or maybe not. You see, you my daughter now hint, lives in buddy? Sector 8, so... Do you think Wu Tai's to blame? Have you heard the rumors? Someone's help trying to take down Please. Shinra. I'm sure Sector 7's affected, too. No, Shinra wouldn't let that happen. I can't stop thinking about it. The bomb I made shouldn't have produced an explosion that big. It doesn't make any sense. The explosion triggered a reaction with the Mako. You said so yourself. That was my first guess, but shouldn't the reactor have fail-safes to prevent that kind of thing? Hmm. You mentioned invisible enemies back there, right? Right. Oh, no. I'm just looking for excuses for something that was clearly my own fault. I own up to it if I'm gonna learn from this and move on. Thanks, Cloud. You're a good listener. Maybe some grounders did it as payback? Don't be stupid. Yeah, the slums have power too. What kind of maniacs would go so far as to bomb a reactor? <sighs> They've yet to announce it publicly, but I heard it was Avalanche's doing. Really? Aren't they the terrorists who tried to kill the president? Is there nothing they won't do? Hey, quit talking out your ass. 
Everyone knows Avalanche only cares about saving the planet. Hmm? Just, just who do you think you are? A law-abiding concerned citizen. Law-abiding? Really? Hmm. Uh, 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 shh. I'll antagonize you. In my humble opinion, that explosion was a message. A message to the bastards bleeding our planet dry. Think they got it? Heard it loud and clear? Y'all's masters? We will not submit to intimidation or violence, but work together for peace and prosperity. That is how civilized people change the world. That's right. That is the Shinra Creed. <laughs> Those fighting words. It's what we believe. We all have to follow our conscience, don't we? We should go. Right. <laughs> Creed my ass. We're the good guys, damn it. You hear that suit? Shinra Creed my ass. <laughs> Let's get this out of the way. Personally, I find visual aids make the dull stuff a lot more bearable. If it helps, think of it as an initiation rite. How many times do I have to tell you people? I'm not. <laughs> There's such a thing as playing too hard to get. So, here we've got a wireframe model of the great city of Midgar. Complete with massive steel plates suspended 300 meters above ground level. Atop which stands a shining beacon of civilization. The whole system is sustained by the Mako reactors, which feed the insatiable appetites of the public. The train will be passing through an ID checkpoint shortly. This here is the train's route. As you can see, it'll take us around this main pillar. Look, we're about halfway through it now. They've set up a checkpoint here to scan the IDs of all passengers heading in and out. Date of birth, residential status, criminal history, all that and more is automatically cross-referenced in their databases. Public security wouldn't have it any other way. Heads up. Don't worry. Our IDs are impeccable. What'd I tell you? Have a little faith. Won't be long till we reach the bottom. Relax. Take a good look. It's because of that great big pizza in the sky that people down there gotta struggle to survive. Shinra sucks up Mako, while the soil turns to dust, the air fills with smog, and the flowers die. Then leave and don't look back. <sighs> that's what's always worked for me. <sighs> well, that's all well and good. If you own the out for yourself. But the folks down there don't have the luxury of choice, you know? Like this train, I suppose. There's only one way it can go.
Don't worry, I'm fine. Oh, Thank goodness. <laughs> no, it couldn't be that bad. No way. Uh, 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 damn, we are good! Yes! <laughs> Bombs detonated one, members lost zero. And one step closer to a brighter future. Hell yeah! Guys! Lower your voices, huh? People are listening. Oh, God. Ah. Ah. Hm. Now get some r, &R. You've earned it. Just be ready for the next mission, all right? Hmm. <laughs> See you soon. Uh. At Seventh Heaven. You know, where Tifa works. Don't keep her waiting. She'll worry. So, what do Not we... Not long now. Yeah, <laughs> about it, baby girl. How about what? Yeah. Yeah. Train services? I feel like it's been... So the Mako reactor's broken? Well, then you can fall in love with Pride Marsh all over again. We'll be up and running. It's good to be back, man. Hey, back of the line. Sure is, sweetie. No words can describe okay. how bright the place was. The kind of person he goes around. So I'm afraid he's only had it so good because of the reaction. Mm -hmm. I've never seen anything like it before. It was completely mm. Huh? Sector 8 was a nightmare. Fires everywhere. Huh. Mako is the lifeblood of the planet? Yeah, the hell it is. Goddamn eco warriors with their dumbass posters. I tear them down and they're back up inside of an hour. Like I've got nothing better to do. I mean, look at all that steel work. You trying to tell me that's not progress? <laughs> what the? You okay, buddy? <laughs> Mako junkie, huh? Figures. You again. That hot shower can't come soon enough. I can barely tell my skin from all the ash and sweat. When I get back, it's uh, hey, excuse me. And you, Jesse? Uh, due to an emergency, entry into this area is prohibited. Sorry for the inconvenience. You call that a warning? No, sir! In accordance with emergency regulations, entry into this area is prohibited. Please, leave at once. Still too nice! Remember the last time I saw a real one? Huh? <laughs> <sighs> How sweet. When did you get so thoughtful? A guy can change. It has been five years. Huh? I need to talk to Barrett. Right. Come on in. Daddy, the Mako place blew up. Everyone on TV is talking about it. Don't you worry about all that silliness. Daddy's here and he's not going anywhere tonight. Now turn that thing off and let's get you to bed, huh? <laughs> 
good girls do? They go to bed on time. Come on. But I'm not tired. I want to talk some more, Daddy. Mm, all right, but just this once. <sighs> uh, so then, what can I get you? My money. I'm still waiting on it. Uh, right. About that. We should talk outside. Um, Daddy? Did the people who died all return to the planet? Of course. Before we get on to money, there's an empty apartment in a place just down the road. It's nothing fancy, but I was thinking you could stay there for now. The landlady's a big friend of the cause, so you wouldn't even have to pay rent. Sound good? Sure does. Thanks. <laughs> Follow me, then. How was it up on the plate? It was... chaotic. When the Sorry for exploded, dragging you into all this. Was it was wrong it was of me crazy. to put you in danger like that. I, heard about that I on promise the I won't do it again. Danger's part of the job. Don't worry about me. <laughs> I'll try not to. Always happy to help stick it to Shinra. <laughs> Not good at all. I don't know what it is, but my life feels so, so empty. you make nice with everyone? As much as I could, all things considered. Void, I know just Maybe the not place. enough for them. Where? Good. Walmart. You had me worried. You're not exactly a people person. I'll give you that. I saw Sector 8 on the news. It was like a war zone. The news is just another Shinra mouthpiece. They'll spread whatever lies Shinra tells them to. I think they'll attack so Sector 7? It the wasn't that bad? This on it was. Oh, right. And here we are. Good old Stargazer Heights. You're on the second floor. Room 201 here is where I sleep. Don't have time for much else, what with 7th Heaven and all. <laughs> Not even time to decorate. Here's your room, 202. Don't worry, I already told the landlady about you. You did? Yes? Oh, I mean I told her I had a friend looking for a place to stay. Was that too much? No, it's fine. And this? That one's, uh... Know what? It's getting late. I'll introduce you tomorrow. It's a little bare, but should be enough to get you through the night. If you want anything else, we can always there get it. There is one thing. My money. You guys owe me 2,000, remember? I do. And we'd love to settle up, especially since this was your first job for us, but... That's it? Sorry. We spent the rest preparing for the mission. That really is it. But not for long. I'm collecting money for filters tomorrow, so I can pay you after. <sighs> and you're sure about that? Of course, as long as you help, that is. Wait, then I'd have to pay you for that, too. Never mind. No, two thousand's enough. That's what we agreed on, so that'll be the price. With what you gave me, that leaves fifteen hundred. You're the best! I'll see you bright and early at the bar, then. Thanks again for everything. Sleep tight. <sighs>
guess it's time for introductions. But he's not a bad guy. The landlady asked me to check on him now and then to make sure he's okay. Can I ask you to do the same? Sure. Well now, you must be Cloud. I'm Marl, your landlady. So how'd you like the place? You from up on high? I've been around. I'll bet. No matter. All kinds come through with all kinds of reasons. If you ever need an ear to bend, I'll lend you mine. Can be about anything. Even Tifa. What's she to you? The granddaughter I never had. And if you hurt her, I'll take it out of your hide. You hear me? Loud and clear. Good. Now you'd best get a move on to Seventh Heaven. She's got a head start on you and then some. Nothing to report. Containing surveillance. What's gonna happen to Nick? My husband decided to go to the state. Just imagine if rich people struggle. Eh? Yeah. Another day I can't work because I can't get the things up. Shipments from 
music. Don't take your eyes. Yes, enjoy yourselves. It's like they don't even care a reactor blew up. Hope he's okay. Last I knew, he was posted in Reactor 1. Haven't heard from him since it blew. Hello there. You must be that friend of Tifa's I've heard so much about. The mercenary? I've got fingers in a few pies myself. Worked with a lot of businesses. Even Seventh Heaven, on occasion. <laughs> what I'm saying is, you and me, we're not so different. And certainly not complete strangers. In fact, I want you to think of me as family. You know, an uncle or maybe a distant relative. Oh, but while I have you here, you wouldn't happen to be interested in grappling guns, would you? Great for getting up or down in a jiffy. I ordered some for a client, but I accidentally added a zero, and now I have a ton to spare. Was thinking of setting up an attraction where you jump from the top of the Shinra building. You know, for the adrenaline junkies. But the fellas at Shinra didn't think it was such a great idea. <laughs> hey, Merc, what's with the glum face? You know, you ought to meet my son, Johnny. He'll turn that frown upside down. He's got a big old heart and a real way with people. Can't help but cheer him up. Or maybe that's just how I see him, because he's my son. <laughs> Love him for who he is. I know. There's no better way to unwind after a hard day's work than a drink at Seven Heaven. People are beginning to stock up. Probably realize it's a sad day when people can ward up what's in the wallet and what's happening with the planet. Morning. Hey. Just so you know, Marlene's still asleep. <sighs> Let's get down to business, shall we? Huh? These water filters won't replace themselves. <laughs> Although the next batch probably could, if Jessie put her mind to it. <sighs> Most every home in the area has one. <sighs> Folks love them because they practically eliminate the rotten egg smell. Honestly, they make us more money than this place. And it's easy money, too. <sighs> we bring new filters, collect the old ones, and get paid. What? Give me a break. I'm not a salesman. I'm a soldier. Which is why no one will refuse to pay. What do you say? Uh. Please? <sighs> Let's get this over with. Great. And while we're at it, I'll give you the grand tour. Go ahead and keep whatever we collect. Seeing as you didn't bring any luggage, I'm guessing there's stuff you need to buy. Thanks. So many people that just and don't worry, any more we'll pay you the difference after. Barrett's out making his rounds too. Don't take your eyes off The new loveless music song with creepy All the items you can want are straight from the plate. No matter your needs or your budget, our items is Hey there. Here to change out your water filter. Tifa, baby, how you doing? Been waiting for you to... Wait, who's he? Cloud's in charge of collections. He'll take your money. Sounds like a pretty sweet gig. If you ever need someone to fill in, I'm your man. In your dreams, maybe. Huh? Uh, since we're here, maybe we should do a little shopping. Suppose I could take a look.
If you're ever in the market for anything else, drop on by. Especially if Teef is with you. We'll see you around, okay? And let us know when your filter next needs changing. What you see is what we got. He's a regular. Stock up here and he might throw in a freebie or two. For you, maybe. Well, you could try being a little nicer. To get free shit? Not my style. <laughs> Our next stop is Stargazer Heights. Landlady's a client. Just met her. Then you know what to expect. Remember, she's a good friend of Avalanche, so be nice. Please. Can't help but take a little pleasure in their panic. Apparently it was done by a terrorist group called Avalanche. Nothing to report. Maintaining surveillance. Hey, Marl. Got some filters for ya. Tifa! My dear, dear girl! Oh, what's he doing here? Working? Be nice. <laughs> Cloud's helping me with collections. You better take care of her. I'm pretty good at taking care of myself, you know. That I do. Still, better him than you. No charm, no wit, big sword, but no skills. I've got skills. Be nice. I'm doing my best. You're looking awfully glum. Are you getting enough sleep? A good long rest will cure anything, I tell you. A tried and true lesson for life on the ground floor, am I right? That you are. Now, your money. Thanks, Marl. You take care of yourself. Don't do anything I wouldn't do. Don't you still have work to do? Well, go on then. Get back to it. You'd better not cause Tifa any heartache. You'd have more color in your cheeks if you went to bed earlier. Don't you still have work to do? Well, go on then. Get back to it. Marl's great. She helped get me set up back in the day. You been here a while now? Five years, give or game. take. How? But never mind that. Absolutely. We've got to get you your money. Last stop is the weapon store. Trains don't start moving again. I don't have enough food and other goods to go around. Hey, if it isn't Tifa. You here for the filter? Yes, huh. pretty cool. Hey! That last filter didn't do shit! We're so sorry about that. Hopefully this one will work better. Save your excuses and get out! All right. If you could just settle your bill, we'll be on our way. The hell? You charging me for your busted-ass goods? My associate handles payment disputes. Think you can mosey up in here and have it your way? Pretty please. <laughs> Thank you very much. Seeing as we're done with our rounds and you've got a small fortune now, why not take a gander at the weapons? Well, when will Barrett be back with the rest? Before we open up tonight. It'll be a while yet, so... What do you want to do? Don't really know. In that case, I've got a suggestion. Want to hear it? If you're serious about becoming a merc, then you're going to need to start making connections. It's not what you know, but who you know, you know? Hmm. Another lesson for life on the ground floor? Yep. Connections get you jobs. Jobs build your rep. And more rep gets you better connections. How do I start? Hmm. Why not help out the Neighborhood Watch? They're mostly volunteers, but you'll get to know people. Yeah, okay. Didn't see anybody at the office, so let's head up top. 
No better way to keep you and your family safe than with a weapon of your own. Come and check out our selection. Speak with our friendly staff to find the perfect weapon for you and your needs. I you think there's any way they can make huh? it a little bit lighter? I ain't got nothing for a punk-ass bitch like you! Get on out of here! Huh? I ain't got nothing for a punk-ass bitch like you! Get on out of here! No better way to keep you and your family safe than with a weapon of your own. Come and check out our selection. Speak with our friendly staff to find the perfect weapon. Even our facilities are starting to look a little run down, don't you think? Everybody does. We keep putting off maintenance. Noises that worry me. <laughs> huh? hmm? Gotta stay focused, even on break. It's the little noises that worry me. Everybody does. We keep putting off maintenance. Gotta do something about the monsters on Scrap Boulevard. I'll head on down there first thing tomorrow. Not alone, you won't. Huh. Didn't know you were holding down the fort. Huh? Oh, hey, Cloud. Looking to join the neighborhood watch? That depends. What does this neighborhood watch do? Uh, lots of stuff, really. But our top priority is taking care of any beasts that wander into town. That, and teaching the locals how to defend themselves. Like they say, the only one who will look out for you is you. Cloud's a great fighter, but only we know that. If no one knows him, no one will hire him. Thought if he joined the Watch, he could get his name out there. That would work for everybody. Truth be told, we could really use your help. We can't pay you in Gil, but we'll work something out. For example... Aha! What about your sword? I could mod it for you. No thanks. It's fine just the way it is. What? Are you some kind of purist? I know I'd never pass up a chance to improve my gear. Come on. At least let me show you how it's done.
All set? Needless to say, you'll have to try it out to appreciate the difference. Thanks. <laughs> we'll do you one better. Spread the word to everyone who'll listen about the new Mercantown. Between him and Wedge, there isn't anyone they don't know. I'll march through the streets singing your praises, even on an empty stomach. So, where are these monsters? Scrap Boulevard. Good hunting. Hey, Cloud, I'll come with. No, I've got this. But you don't know the way, do you? We are. <laughs> sure thing. I know these streets better than anyone. because you think it looks cool, are you? Scrap Boulevard is out west. The Past the barricades, supposed to keep the monsters out. Anyway, anyway, we should prepare, just in case. Everybody does. We keep putting off maintenance. It's the little noises that worry. Got it, man. so they could save the planet? More like they want us to give up our way of life. There will be no way of life for anyone. But I say people and their jobs and their families have to come first. Otherwise, what's the point? Searching for candidates. No way we can afford the rent on our place. I'll start looking for a new one. Living in a dump somewhere. Is that who Wedge mentioned? That sword's massive. What does he sell again? Good luck, Tifa, and be careful! Here's Scrap Boulevard. I can see why monsters would feel right at home. <laughs> and the more we pile up, the more they show up. what a soldier looks like in action. This was just a warm-up. <laughs> I'll bet. Let's keep at it.
You're good at this. Charging in like it was nothing. You too. It's a little surprising. Well, I've been here five years now. If you don't look out for yourself, no one else will. By the way, that one's gonna be on the <laughs> This is awesome. Not a yeah. if you're gonna stick around. Okay, yeah. let's wrap this up. Alright. Alright. I think that might be the last of them. They won't stay gone for long. Of course not. Even so, folks will be grateful for the peace and quiet in the meantime. A win's a win, you know? True. Trust me, it'll do wonders for your rep. Right, let's go check in with Biggs and Wedge. Searching for candidates. I hear you sell swords. Charlie, like Monster Slain is an update. Got new numbers for Monster Slain this month. Check them out. We just opened up shop here. Call us if you see trouble. to keep you and your family safe and with a weapon of your own come and check out our selection we staff to find the perfect weapon for you and your needs no better way to keep you and your family safe than I want to if there's any way they can make our guns a little lighter we're always to be honest Someone got rid of all the monsters on the Hey, it's that guy who will do anything you ask. First to warn everybody. Ah! Still got some left in the tank. Hey, it's that guy who will do anything you ask. Back already? Got every last one, too. Now the slum should be safe. You guys are machines! Good job. Meanwhile, we told everyone we could about you. So I heard. I've gotta ask, though. What did you tell them? It's all right. All you gotta do is keep up the good work. It'll pay off soon enough, I promise. How's the sword, by the way? Good. Glad to hear it. Seems like the perfect fit for you. Yeah. We've been through a lot. Oh. You okay? I'm 
fine. Been meaning to ask. After you left the village... <laughs> it's a long story. I've got time. Why don't you tell me all about it while we try to wrestle up some more work for you? That sounds great! I'll come too! Oh, uh, no you won't. What? Run along now, you two. Sorry, Go on. maybe uh. next time. Huh? No fair! Uh. Think about it for a second. They haven't seen each other in years. You'd be a third wheel. <sighs> hey, before we get back to it, why don't you check out the weapons? No need. Come on, the dealer's probably heard all about you by now. Might treat you better. I don't know about that. You hear someone got rid of all the monsters on Scrap Boulevard? No, oh, that was supposed to be me! You hear someone got rid of all the monsters on Scrap Boulevard? No, oh, that was supposed to be me! Someone got rid of all the monsters on Scrap Boulevard? No, that was supposed to be me. No better way to keep you and your family safe? Hold up. Heard there's a merc that'll take on any monster. You the man? Word spreads fast around here. What if I am? Sorry about before. I get antsy when business is slow. Ugh. Man in your line of work needs weapons, no? Why not try that one on for size? Yours on the house. Badass like you rocking my weapons is good advertising. Think about it. Fine. Or if you want to take a look at something else. Just a look. Be a stranger. Since you've got yourself a new weapon, let's see if we can't put it to good use. Come on, let's go chat up Weimer. Who? The guy who tracks all the requests that come to the watch. You never know. Could toss some work your way. Where's he at? Oh, he should be back at the office by now. Until they get reaction searching for candidates. You're our go to monster slayer now. I can finally sleep at night. Searching for candidates. Back to living in a dump somewhere. Ah, <clears throat> oh, hey there, Chiefa. 
You need a helping hand? Actually, I wanted to introduce you to an old friend of mine. This is Cloud. He's a merc. Ah, you don't say. Well, we're always on the lookout for experienced fighters to help us deal with the bigger critters. I'll take on anything. For the right price, that is. Experienced and cocky, huh? If it's a challenge you want, I might have a few good ones. Your clients can fill you in on the details. Prove yourself with these jobs, and I'll see if I can't find you some more. Thanks. Candidate detected. Performing physical analysis. Sizable weapon. Excellent cardiovascular health and impressive lung capacity. Perfectly balanced muscle and bone structure. An optimal candidate. My name is Chadley. I'm an intern for Shinra's Research and Development Division. I hope you'll be interested in helping me with my research. Please accept this as a down payment. I would like you to set that assessed materia in your equipment and use it to gather intelligence in battle. This data will help me to develop new types of materia. I'm not interested in working for Shinra. You should know that I work actively to undermine Shinra's efforts. I'm sure you of all people can appreciate the tremendous power of materia, as well as how it might be wielded against your corporate enemies. And if you later decide that I am not worthy of your trust, you can do what you do best. I will hold you to that. Excellent! Then we shall work together so long as you deem fit. Once you've completed your task, please return and report to me. Please set the orb of assessed materia to your equipment and use it to gather battle intel. You'll never want for work around here if you prove yourself useful.
Until they get Reactor 1 back up and running, the factory's gonna stay shut down. Where all the plate side jobs are one off gigs. No matter how hard I work, I've still got a hustle. Hey! Oh, hey there! Uh, is Marlene with you? No. Oh, okay. I was kind of hoping she could help me find my friends. I know someone who can help you. This guy right here. Really? Okay, let me tell you all about them. They have long arms and legs, and they're a little skinny. They like places where there's food, and nice people will give them treats when they ask. And small spaces. Oh yeah, and they're all cats. I'm looking for cats? They're friendly, so if you call them, they'll come running, all three of them. Find my friends, please. What's the source of all life? The life stream, right? Why'd you tell about our secret plan? I don't know. For the wedding. How they much love crowded places, the like the road to the station. A lot of people stop to play with them there. What's the What's the Lots of girls who live here have the potential. The lights. They'll also go wherever there's free food. Marlene says she always gives them some snacks when they go to 7th Heaven. What's the source of all life? The life... get a cat to come out. It snatched one of my pastries and scurried in there. Will you be a deer and lend me a hand? Sucks. Good. Quality product makes a huge difference. Oh, for the love of I'm sick and tired of chasing this little guy around.
I've been seeing more and more cats around here lately. <laughs> it's so bad. We might have to close up shop. Another day I can't work because I can't get inside. Chili beans! Get your chili beans! You a lover? You a fighter? No. And of course, they all come to me for food, as cats do. Ooh, good. Quality product makes a huge difference, just like that. I can't complain. They're so adorable. Just like that. I was gonna jump on that empty room at Stargazer Heights, but someone beat me to it. The tally of Monster Slain has been updated. Got new numbers for Monster Slain this month. Check them out. Hmm. You're our go-to Monster Slain. Merge and cleaned up Scrap Boulevard. Nice job, buddy. Keep up the good work, Tifa. Let's see what he's made. Heard you cleaned up Scrap Boulevard. Nice job, buddy. <sighs> I can finally sleep at night. My husband decided to go to the station and see if it had gotten in. It's so bad. We might have to close up shop. No matter your needs, all your budget Hey there, Tifa. Welcome back. And you, the new Mercantown looking for work, right? Yeah. In that case, maybe you could do something about the Doom Rats? Them and their were rat buddies have been tearing up town looking for food and whatnot. Got into the store and made one hell of a mess, let me tell you. <laughs> oh, you think that's funny, do you? Don't lie. I saw you crack a smile. Well, do the job and you can laugh it up for all I care. Anyway, they're probably nesting in the outskirts. Now I've heard a were rat in pain will call its friends for help. And the whole rat pack will come running just like that. Just imagine if rich people start on the plate. No 
enough for the move down. You a lover? You a fighter? Yes, no so. worries. We've got anything. Might have I stopped by later? We won't be getting any more shipments until the trains start again. If none of the trains are running, I assume the factories and sectors. There's one. Nate got hit too. I figured I should at least stock up on food for my kids before they're getting left. Don't take your eyes off it! The new Hoods of them. All the items you could want! If I can get a ticket there. Some creepy dude who hit us. No matter your needs or your budget, our wide selection of items is guaranteed. You a lover? You a fighter? No worries, we got any. Apparently, it was done by a terrorist. Don't hold back. You got it. That's that. It's over. You're done. I don't see any doom rats around. Hmm. What do you think? Should we wait? You know. This might be a waste of time. Let's head back to the store and touch base for now. Oh, hey, 
this look like a blood stain to you? Shit. That always there? Shops on Culvert Street stock goods you won't find in more reputable establishments. I spent on her, but I'll tell her she's worth all the gill and She never asked folks about the supply. Got the latest and greatest camera brand goods for all that go. Looks like a real hard ass, but actually pretty chill. Hmm, which one are you thinking? Mm -hmm. What's the big sword for? Hey, Miss Lockhart, who's that guy you're with? Where all the plate side jobs are one off gigs. No matter how hard I work, I see a lot of cats hanging out near the beginner's hall, too. You know the place. It's the one with all the houses around it. to the station. A lot of people stop to play with them there. What's the source of it? Uh, 
You know, the item store has fallen on hard times. No matter your needs. Or hmm. Just imagine if rich people. Apparently, it was done by a terrorist. That landlady, Marl, she's... The watch is saying they're gonna step up their game. Please set the orb of assessed materia to your equipment and use it to gather battle intel. Back to living in a dump somewhere. Please set the orb of assessed materia to your equipment and use it to gather battle intel. Oh. You're gonna have to talk to your clients if you want all the details. Do me proud now, and I just might have more work for you later. You're gonna have to talk to your clients if you want all the details. I hear you sell swords. Might want to introduce yeah. you. You're the aspiring odd jobber, right? You just opened up shop. Don't try anything Don't funny. Or you'll get it. I swear, all the plate side jobs are one off gigs. No matter how hard I work, I've still got a house. They'll also go wherever there's free food. Marlene says she always gets them some snacks when they go to Seventh Heaven. What's the source of all that? We're getting married at the yeah. <sighs> It might be a good idea to stock up on food before it's all gone. I'm not gonna let you sleep over. Huh? You want a piece of me? Wait, did you think hear that just now? Money if we I think one of Betty's cats parts? might be nearby. Looks damn near rusted through to me. I'm game as long as it buys us around. Screw this.
What? They ran away? So, I'm never gonna see them again? You guys! You came back! They said that a scary man was chasing them. <laughs> Thank you! That went well. Could be you found your calling. Eh. Was all right, I guess. Think of each job as an opportunity. Not to make money, but to build connections. It's not what you know, but who. <laughs> you remembered. Not a patient teacher. <laughs> Maybe not so patient next time. Oh, boy. <laughs> oh, Barrett should have finished collecting his share of the money by now. So what do you want to do? Head back to the bar? Lots of girls who live... One day I'll turn on the TV and see Jesse and all the others. I've been told the sewage smells gone. Fear is in the mind. Fear is in the mind. Biggs is teaching me self-defense techniques. Aha, the man with the strange job. My husband decided to go to the station. What's gonna happen to Mika? It was just one reactor, dear. Everything's gonna be fine. Out of avalanche. Gotta admit, the watch is a lot more impressive than it was a couple of years back. Probably because of those things that joined up after the season. I hear you, so To you, kid. What canned goods when I get sick of? Thinking I might join in one of those. There's no space, man. Have you ever tried saving money? Yeah. Have you ever heard the phrase living hand to mouth? They were sick. Something's wrong. Let's check it out. <laughs> that Johnny. What's he done this time? I hope he's okay. Stay away from me! Hold it! Settle down now. Get off me, assholes! I didn't do shit! Shut up, punk! Or what, huh? Screw you! What's Come going on? on? Why you Somebody gotta do me like went that? and stole some blasting data from a you. Shinra warehouse. So public security started asking questions, and you know how Johnny gets. It's because of the reactor bombing, I bet. I could be wrong, but something tells me they're not gonna settle for just roughing him up this time. We've gotta save him, Cloud. Is he Avalanche? No. He doesn't really know what we do. But he has his suspicions. And... He's a talker. Actually, you know what? Maybe I should go alone. I'm coming. Uh, are you sure? It's the least I can do. Lead on. <sighs> Thanks. Come on. He could go to jail. Will he be all right? You gotta follow Tifa. Why would you provoke Shinra like that? What's this gonna mean for us? He's got all the screw public security. I'm not to help, but you What did that idiot do now? They come in and act like they What the hell, man? You trying to break my arm? Dragging me through the street like this is... Midgar. 
Model citizens don't steal blasting agent. So why don't you tell me why your ID popped when we were going over the warehouse logs? Huh? You got it all wrong. I've never thought anywhere near a Shinra warehouse. Uh. My ID. <laughs> your ID was never lost. Never got you inside a Shinra installation in the first place. I swear, all he had to do was keep his mouth shut. Yep. Anyway, you distract the officers and I'll figure something out. Let him go. Hmm? Who are you? The cavalry? Huh? Is that... Is that who I think it is? Oh, hell yeah! You guys really came to save me! Out of all level! Uh -huh. Hey! You know you think you're doing it! Here we go. <laughs> He's a talker. Huh? Whoa, whoa! No! Huh? You're not gonna... Hold up! Wait! Don't, don't do it, man! You wanna live? Then get the hell out of town. <laughs> you, you got it, boss! You ain't never gonna see my face again! I swear! <laughs> Are you sure about this? It's a big risk. I know, but... It's fine. And them? No more. Cloud, you're scaring me. <clears throat> we need to go before they wake up. I'm worried about Johnny. I'm more worried about us. We gotta go, right? Right. What? It's just... You've really changed. How? I suppose it's... Yeah. Your eyes. They used to be less... It's the Mako. Soldier, remember? I remember. So, what do you want to do now? Head back to the bar, or do you want to tackle another job or two? Skipping town. Hopefully, he's joking about me. Hey, don't rush it and drop your tools. Take your time now, okay?
But does this mean you understand? What's got me to tell You won't get the best of me. Thinking I might and have here we are. You must be tired. Same as you, I guess. Could use a little something to take the edge off, right? How about a refreshing cocktail made by yours truly that you can sit back and savor? Tifa. Yeah, I'm feeling it a bit too. Hey, do you think you'll stick around a little longer? <sighs> Maybe. Work for a minute, build up some savings. I see. In that case, want to head back out and look for more gigs? Of fun. Hey, need y'all downstairs. Uh, right now? Then the plan is... Marlene, wanna go wait for Jesse out front? Okay. <sighs> Looks like we're officially on for tomorrow night then. Gotta go over the details with the others. Before you do, about my pay... You'll get your money. So sit down and shut up until we're finished. Double time, Tifa. Sorry, but it shouldn't take much longer. In the meantime, <laughs> grab a seat. What'll it be? I don't know. Something hard and bitter. <laughs> Most people would say something sweet right about now. I'm sure they would. Ah, uh, but you're a more discerning customer, aren't you? In which case... Our house special, the Cosmo Canyon. Beautiful. I gotta go. <laughs> Enjoy. Huh? Hey, you see the news? The reactor bombing was the work of the eco-extremist group Avalanche. Public enemy number one. Gets your heart racing, doesn't it? They don't know our faces, so we're in the clear for now. But we'll want to capitalize on this momentum. Speaking of which, you coming on the next one? For the right price. Oh, you can bet I'll be pushing hard for a raise. <sighs> Tifa will be joining us too, but I don't know. Even a blind man can see her heart's not in it. She was never on board with the bombings. So if it comes down to do or die... If I've got to put my life in someone else's hands... I'd rather that someone was a professional, like you. Could still kill some time.